Kevin Trojanowski from Omaha area. We're out here flying a 60%, well, getting ready to fly a 60% Pershing II, uh, flying on a Derek DeVille Q11000, about 87,000 Newton seconds, rocket weighs 475 pounds on the pad. A uh, little bit more with the guys up on the tower, but they won't let me fly them even though those guys are disposable. All right, so how long do you think it's going to be before you're ready to push the button? Realistically? No, tell me like 20 minutes like you always do. <laughs> 30 minutes. <laughs> and the, uh, the, the rocket, sponsored by Lowe's, Home Depot, Menards, um, DeWalt. If it doesn't use 110, we didn't use it, and viewers like you. All right, thanks. Sure. Right behind you! Hey! Where's the other part? Alright, Kevin, so tell me. We yeah. flew a rocket! I'm glad you didn't start trying to certify on this one either. <laughs> Whoop! I'm just dropping all your stuff. That's See, okay. that's what you get for messing with me. Seems like you're dropping everything. Hey, 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 I am just hey, reducing guys. the amount of stuff I have to haul home. This way, this doesn't go in storage with redstone. I guess so. The redstone. So, so what do you think happened? The uh, motor outperformed what we expected. GPS was telling us 1,100 feet per second. Um, all the bolts fired on the way up. We think we got a little too close to Mach, and it spoofed the altimeters, and they didn't know what was going on. Hmm. But all the explosive bolts fired, which tells us that's what caused the nose to separate, because the altimeters are all in the upper section. So the bolts couldn't have fired and still been attached to the lower if uh, at Apogee, if that had happened. That's tape. Okay. That's just masking tape, holding shear pins. Here's so. A, how big of a hole did you put out there? Um, this is Kansas concrete, so it's only about a foot. We just need a shovel to dig a couple of pieces out so we don't leave too much trash behind. Okay, and the casing is still good? Or? Uh, Looks like the motor outperformed a little, did a little strain relief. Both bulkheads got pushed out about an eighth of an inch. Wow. So Derek's comment was, look, look oh, that's Bob, look cool. Bob, for you. Hey, look, Bob the or birdhouse. behind you. The birdhouse. Yeah. Say hi. I'm on candid camera. No, you're not. It's not anymore. <laughs> I'm on splatted camera. Um, Houston, we have an anomaly. I'll say you do. <laughs> we may be able to fix that. We'll see. But um, motor outperformed what was expected, and we think it uh, pushed it a little fast. So you're going to rebuild it and try it again? We'll see. We have other ideas, too. All right, well, Any of them good? <laughs> was it spectacular? <laughs> Did we provide you entertainment without hurting anybody? Oh, absolutely. Did the motor work? Oh, oh, no. That's the question. No. no, no did the motor that. kick ass? Yes. He's yeah, motor blaming kick this all on you. He said the motor outperformed and his rocket couldn't take Not my stress. fault he can't build a rocket. <laughs> <laughs> We're okay with that. Derek, if he's going to build them like that, he can build us a motor anytime. <laughs> yeah. That was cool. Kevin that was exceeded the. the uh, to ever fly here. And the worst. <laughs> you were doing good until you qualified, right? Know what you're Thank you. Well, Kevin, you exceeded the uh, exceeded the speed of cardboard twice in one launch. What do you have to say? <laughs> <laughs>
actually, we in this case, it was we exceeded the speed of the altimeters. Now, now next time, you're going to get a building permit. Well, actually, we think we're going to get Bob Vila to come and help us with some renovations on this one. Uh huh. Yeah. Well, it looks like uh, this one's a tear down now. Yeah, yeah, it's <laughs> it's a little heavy on the reconstruction, but you know. A dedicated carpenter can have it back together in a couple of weeks. Yeah, nothing. A couple of two by fours, a few sheets of plywood, and a few wood screws won't take care of, right? That's right. And a gallon of wood glue. Uh, two gallons. <laughs> we may have to glue some pieces back together. <laughs> now, is this going to be a National Transportation Safety Board inquiry, or are we just going to keep sweep this one under the rug? Or is this one going to sweep be what OSHA? under the rug? Or, or is this going to be OSHA? <laughs> we can't well, decide see. which. <laughs> or the FAA or... Yeah. Hmm. Well, there was a no, it's, no, no, wait, 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 wait. Yeah. This is an oh, Army oh, missile. Oh. Ballistic trajectory is... It was a nominal... <laughs> I'm trying to fly this rocket. You boys want to carry this somewhere else? <laughs>